Three Chinese astronauts talked from space with youths from eight African countries on Tuesday via video link, sharing their experience in the Shenzhou 14 mission. The Taikonauts Chen Dong, Liu Yang and Chai Shuje are on a six-month stay in orbit. The main venue of the event, Talk with Taikonauts, was at the headquarters of the African Union in Addis Ababa. The rare opportunity to talk with astronauts in orbit has reinvigorated African youth space dreams. I've been dreaming about becoming an astronaut since I was 6, 7, and especially it inspires when Ethiopia launched her first satellite to the space. See, there is a hope for me to become one of the astronauts. The main idea I, I, I infer from this session is astronauts, it doesn't mean just a, a type of uh, Professions that you will learn for three years, four years, and then graduate and then become astronauts. It needs a really, a really hard effort. We have to even work harder, both psychologically, physically, intellectually. We all need to work harder, harder than we are doing right now. It really inspired me to see her on that uh, uh, space uh, because she was very confident and she said like we are equal gendered so that we can do everything. Mm -hmm. So she inspired me and motivated me to do and to increase my interest through this space. Experts said that the event presented a unique opportunity for the African youth to have first-hand experience of space science and outer space exploration. It's an opportunity to motivate African young people to show African young people that everything is possible, to show that space is not different from Earth. You've seen the several applications and you've seen the explanations and answers coming from the Taikonauts, which are very, very well appreciated. In the new space era, Africa is open for mutually beneficial cooperation and it is ready for engagements on all kinds of win-win scenarios. I want to thank China for the deliberate engagements in space advancement in Africa.